You know how they say that your life flashes before your eyes, before you die? Well, I got that chance at the hands of my husband a few years ago. He tried to kill me as our three children slept upstairs. I was working late nights, overnights, and he had called me to say that one of our daughters was hurt, and I sped home not knowing what happened. And when I got home, I saw an empty bottle of liquor. Even though I knew he didn't drink, I knew that something was terribly wrong. And he invited me to come inside. And within moments before I knew it, he had broken a chair over me. He had beaten me. He punched me in the face. He choked me unconscious twice. He told me he would kill me. And he took a knife about seven inches long, about this this big, a big stainless steel kitchen knife, and he stabbed me in the head and hand. And it was the most terrifying thing that I've ever been through in my whole life. And it's something that no human should ever have to live through. No one should ever have to beg someone else for their life. And one of the thoughts I had as he was choking me on the sofa was, this isn't fair. I didn't get to do everything I wanted to do. The two other thoughts that I had were, my parents would find my body here and my children wouldn't have their mother. And that moment changed everything for me. It took me a while to heal and grow spiritually, find my own path, but I did. And I decided to start a business because I knew that I didn't get stabbed and beaten for nothing. Since then, my life has been the most incredible it's ever been. And why it's been that way is because I decided to change who I am. I shifted my way of being. I decided to reclaim my power. What I've manifested and what I've created is this beautiful life. Life is the most amazing it's ever been. I have a happy, healthy, beautiful family, my three children are with me and I have this incredible partner that I never imagined that this kind of love was even possible in this lifetime. And here we are creating the life we want together. And here I am living the life on my own terms and not for anybody else. So now what I'm up to is helping women reignite their sexual fires. I'm helping women be a good mother and a great lover at the same time. Showing women that it is possible. Just because they're a mother doesn't mean that they can't be sexy anymore. This is really a time to embrace all of that, embrace all the beauty, and I'm helping women in general just help them ascend their sexual goddess within. So in fall of 2016 in Toronto, I'm hosting an event to help mothers remind themselves that they are enough and that they can have access to even greater personal power. And I want them to get a taste of that here at the event. So I invite you to come join me. If you are ready to expand your personal power, to have a deep connection with your partner like none ever before, then I invite you to come out. Come join us, come on board. It's gonna be fun, it's gonna be exciting. And I look forward to seeing you in fall 2016.